Okay, everyone, I'm here with my only granddaughter, <laughs> Miss Chloe Haskins. Say hi, hi. Chloe. And um, she drew me the best picture ever. I haven't posted it yet or anything because I want to ask her permission, but she drew me when she found out that her grandmother was for real a BTS fan, that she drew me a picture of them. For Christmas. And, and for Christmas, and it's really cute. So I will be showing that when um, I get opportunity. I'm not sure yet if I want to, because I don't want anyone like reposting it and doing stuff, so I have to figure out how I'm gonna do that. So Chloe, what do you think about, you You only see me like two times a year, and, and so what do you think about me being a BTS fan? I mean, you know, it's fine. I'm glad that you have something that you like and you're happy about. And you know, their music is good, so. Mm -hmm. So what did, what did I do to you when I first saw you when you came in town for the holidays? What happened? Tell well, them what happened. Uh, I ended up sitting with my grandmother and like she was watching, a, we were both watching a bunch of videos about BTS. And then my dad came at one point and started playing the Adele new album. And then we listened to that. And then I think we went back to listen to BTS. Yeah, we did. And I was playing my playlist on my phone. I don't know if I was still at your dad's house or not. And all of a sudden it switched because I have several artists on there and it switched to um, leave the door open and it got to what you doing. And she started singing, <laughs> what you doing? Where are you at? I said, what do you know about, what do you know about that? Leaving the door open. It's a really good song. Right. Do you know what it's about? Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, she's, she is um, almost 15, I guess. So. Uh, she's going to know about that. But she's the new high school student this year. But she's been stranded here. Her flight, how many times has your flight been uh, postponed? Like three times. Three times. So she's, I think, missing school. But they might have the schools closed back in Virginia. I'm not sure. I Are haven't they? missed school yet. They were closed every single time. Oh, that's good. So you're not going to yeah. be behind. That's great. So what's your favorite BTS song? Do you have one? I don't have one because I only listen to them when you're talking about it. Wow. Wow. <laughs> what about the your favorite BTS member? I don't have one. Okay. She's not really ARMY, but you know what? I'm going to work on her. I did give her a sweatshirt. Are you going to wear it? I did wear it. Oh, you already wore it? Yeah. Awesome. I gave her a BTS sweatshirt for Christmas. So and that's not it, but I did give her one. So she has that. But I thought it'd be fun to record with my granddaughter. I did it with my uh, grandson, who's my oldest grandchild, before I went to the concert. And so Chloe um, gets the honor of talking about it after the concert. But it was a lot of fun. And I told her, if they come anywhere near where she's at, I'm buying tickets and I'm taking her. And I know after that, she's going to be Army for sure. <laughs> so with that, I will close out this little interview. Anything else you want to say before we get off the thing? Well, Chloe is going to be a famous YouTuber someday. Um, because she's an excellent artist, just beautiful work. And she's just getting her her collection kind of together and, and practicing and figuring out her style and the kind of character she wants to portray. I know, to me, it reminds me a little bit of anime, but um, they kind of look like anime. But then on the other hand, they're more some somewhat more realistic looking to me, too. But um, I'm looking forward to seeing where she goes with it and what she decides to do with it. So keep your eyes open for Chloe. <laughs> And hopefully she'll just go by Chloe. <laughs> All right. Talk to you later. Bye. Bye.